Welcome to Tesla Super Destinations, where we review Tesla's charging infrastructure and get to know the cool people there. Today, we're elevating our energy at the Lake Arrowhead Village Supercharger, where else? Lake Arrowhead, California. Let's get charged up. Hello, this is Blue Leader, and we're here in Lake Arrowhead, California, where they have a total of eight superchargers. Thank you so much for following and checking us out on the road as we take a look at the Tesla superchargers and destination chargers. So I just want to express my gratitude. So you know what to do, smash the like if you haven't, smash the subscribe if you haven't, and totally share this content with people that could use our good information and have fun with us along the way. Initial impressions, initial thoughts. First thought, my first thought coming here is, where the heck is it? On the Tesla nav, if you're not paying attention, you're on the third floor, you're underneath the above ground parking structure. Initial feelings, first feeling is this is kind of spooky. It's a little bit dark. It looks very industrial once you get into the supercharger. Initial concerns, not so many concerns. I kind of know where the bathroom is. You go outside and downstairs and there's some restrooms in the village. Let's give our guest Jeff our ear so he can tell us about the area. And Jeff, have you supercharged here in Lake Arrowhead before? I have. Now what can you tell us about this supercharger or maybe the surrounding area? Uh, well, Lake Arrowhead is a great destination. I have relatives that live up here, so I, uh, I come up and uh, I park my car and get it charged and then I get to go enjoy the restaurants and family and friends. Can you recommend any restaurants nearby that you could uh, recommend us to go? Oh goodness, um, I have a terrible memory, but I know uh, Lakefront, they have a brewery and a couple new restaurants and, um, and so just like to enjoy a burger, pizza and a beer down there. Sounds awesome. Now Jeff, if you were a real estate agent and you were selling this supercharger area, this parking garage, what would be your selling points? The location next to all of the restaurants, there's a lot of people that come up here seasonally, uh, boats, water skiing, and people enjoy a lot of uh, their summers up here. I know I do with family and friends. Beautiful scenery, and uh, we love to come up with family and just enjoy a weekend or a whole week. Now, if the Lake Arrowhead Supercharger didn't exist, would you, would you still come to the area? Now having the uh, Tesla Supercharger in here makes it very convenient and uh, I'm very confident coming up here, it's uh, very helpful. One full star for chargers, eight of them at 250 kV, 24 seven. It's underground on level three, so it's not above ground where the village is. You've gotta go around, underneath the parking structure and then work your way all the way back up to level three. A full star for bathrooms, just 136 feet away go downstairs it's on level one outside a full star for safety it's dimly lit kind of spooky but not weird feeling it's indoor parking and remember level three underneath the above ground park a full star for food and beverage you've got your fast food lots of great restaurants bars and a market a full star for cool factor, you will make a lot of miraculous memories here at Lake Arrowhead, especially if you like boats. The Lake Arrowhead Village Supercharger in Lake Arrowhead, California gets a 5.0 TSD rating. Perfect! Non-rated noteworthy mentions, off State Route 189, Lake Edge Road. This is a seasonal supercharger stop, so when it's winter, there'll be snow. When it's summer, you've got the nice sun coming off of the lake. Let's give our guest, Jeff, another listen. What was the coolest thing someone ever did for you? Well, my wife married me, so that was a beautiful thing. I'm sure it is. Now, who is the person that you admire the most? Uh, probably my parents. Uh, they were hard workers and uh, you know, I just got to see a uh, model in action um, and then people who take risks and go for it. And that's kind of how I'm born and bred. Now, as far as your parents go, is there something they did or said to you that sticks with you to this day? Uh, find something you love 
and you'll never work another day in your life. I gotta ask, what are you doing with your life? I am a school teacher. That's an excellent profession, very meaningful and, and impactful. Now, do you have any final words of wisdom for the people out there, Jeff? Take risks, take a leap, and uh, don't look back. Thank you so much. See you later. Bye-bye. Congrats. You made it to the end. Comment your electric thoughts and share with your circle of trust. Thanks for letting us supercharge your Tesla destination. See you at our next super destination. If Elon Musk worked for you, what would he be doing for you? I would definitely give him the reins on any super project that he wanted to work on just because of uh, the great mind he has in uh, just technology and seeing uh, out in front of everything, whether it's 10 years or 50 years, he's a great mind. You know what, that's a mark of a good leader, allowing your people to run and accomplish. So thank you for that one, Jeff. Absolutely.